win. <laughs> Got yes! him! Yes, he has! That's a big one! So Harbison's gone, Clark's done the damage, and it's 8 for 210. Pressure, pressure, pressure. What a delivery. It was bowled a little bit quicker, 90 kilometres an hour. His very first test wicket in Australia. It dripped, it knocked up a little bit of dust, it bit. And that is the end of Habajan. Caught by Hussey of the bowling of Michael Clark. This is how it happened. Have a look at it bounce off the shoulder of the bat, actually. And uh, that's the end of that. Yeah, it was a fizzer from Michael Clark. Ricky Ponning has waited a long time to bowl him and kept him on for the second over. So Harbhajan Singh only managing seven and uh, Australia needing two more wickets now. Harbhajan Singh, left arm medium pacer coming to the crease. Just 22 years of age, what a situation for him. His ninth test match, his captain's 45 not out. Clark's got one to jump and spin. Harvagen caught between coming forward and going back. Good delivery. This what's a tougher dust. Explodes there, bounces, gets the glove, and goes to Hussey. Captain comes over. RP sings, we see that the dismissal again is tougher dust. It was very short actually, it was forward before acceptances. Yeah, now this is going to be the real test because uh, a new batsman comes in confronting this sort of situation. And there it is again, just off the uh, shoulder of the bat. Now you're starting to feel that India were going to get through. I'm not sure now. Only two wickets for Australia and you've got a youngster at the crease. He uh, has stopped for a brief time. The captain has had a chat to him. I'm sure it's just filled him, just encouraged him. Come on, each ball, they tick them off together. But uh, it's now slightly back in favour of Australia. 13 minutes to go. The odds, $8 Australia at the moment. Fraction four, it's spinning and it's straight. He doesn't want to go, but that's out. Good piece of bowling, good captaincy. And it's all happening at the Sydney Cricket Ground. Listen to the crowd, look at the Australians. And what a good performance by Michael Clark when it was needed. Yeah, the Aussie supporters, they're all on their feet now. Michael Clark, where's he been all day? He comes in at the death and he's stealing a couple of wickets. Driving his country to victory. Or is he? They need one more now. That is beautiful bowling. Left arm round the wicket, pitching straight and straightening down the line. Good captain see this by uh, Ricky Ponting. Have a look at that. It pitched on middle and off. And uh, would have been hitting about middle and leg. The bales, that is, of middle and leg. Didn't straight as much as I thought it did with the naked eye, but yeah, no hesitation. The umpire is a judge at LVW, so it's a hat trick. Can Australia win? 19 year old and make his way to the centre of this great cricket ground with the weight of the water on his shoulders to survive with his captain who has been absolutely superb well now put yourself in the position of Sharma the number 11 coming out here everything to play for 19 years of age third test he's playing in He's not rushing, that's for sure. He certainly isn't. But you know they say ignorance is bliss. He's probably not nervous. He's just going out there to play. <laughs> He's got two right-hand gloves. That's not a good stay. He's not nervous at all, is he? That's not as bad as Willis, who went out there without a bat. He mightn't have his box in, though. That's what I'm worried about. <laughs> He's just... Uh, this is one of the old Indian balkers, this one. Well, to be careful, he doesn't get torn, but he should walk out to the crease and somebody should follow him out with the glove. Ponting's getting a little bit frustrated, but it's been one of those test matches. Ponting could have given himself plenty more time. Don't worry about that. Ponting, uh, Ponting could quite easily have given himself a lot more time. Anyhow, he's getting two gloves here. <laughs> have another look at the LBW shout. But live, it looked... Uh, very good indeed 
and first ball faced Michael Clark ripping the ball straight had to straighten it did and look at his teammates they realize that they have been running out of time very fast but uh, Michael Clark has got uh, two in two deliveries he's on a hat trick what an opportunity to get one go down in the history of the game one of the hat trick to win a test match at the Sydney cricket ground for 16 wins on the top for the Australians that was a good delivery that last one it had to straighten it just straightened enough here's the first one a tougher dust bounce glove slip out and then the next one pitches to straighten them up just enough i got to tell you he's got a good chance of a hat trick here if he pitches that in the same this this delivery in the same place that front foot will be across there there could be an lbw hat trick well forward big man get well forward get that pad down the pitch there's about 15,000 people at the scg appealing quick and well played can Kumbway get the strike here there's two balls going to go on this over. Well, that's it. I mean, I think Kumble's just got to hope that he can handle his last two and then he's got to look after it from then on. So, uh, a little conference. Kumble going up to his youngster and saying, well played. And he probably also said to him, keep getting on that front foot. You don't go before the acceptance. Just pick up the line first. Yes! Scores over! Clark's done the damage. Australia win. What a performance. Three wickets in an over. 16 on the track. He hasn't gone yet. He's out. There's no doubt about that. What a test match from day one to day five. And the hero in the end is the unlikely Michael Clark. Oh, wonderful scenes here at the Sydney Creek Ground. Right down to the wire this test match. It's been a wonderful fun right through the test. And here we are now. Look at them. They're so disappointed. The Indian supporters that have come here are absolutely shattered. But what a day for the Australians. Wonderful performance. 2-0 up in the series. 16 Test match wins in a row. And they're going berserk. It looked like India were going to save the Test match. And we got within nine minutes of the close of play on the fifth day. Can you believe it? And they pull off a beauty.